Hey, what's going on guys? I'm gonna make a quick video if you are trying to stream the fight tonight. Tyson Fury 2 or in the future for other fights, UFC fights, etc. ESPN Plus is streaming the fight if you have already cut your cable, which I have. Meaning that obviously we're just streaming. We don't have a cable box. We don't have a provider. We have an Amazon Fire Stick. This is going to work on the regular HD Fire Stick or the 4K Fire Stick. All you're going to do here is if you do not have the ESPN app, what you need to do is you need to download the ESPN app. So up here in the main menu, I'm using a Amazon 4K remote, but it's going to be the same thing minus obviously the volume buttons on the regular 1080p Amazon Fire Stick. So go ahead and hit the home screen there if you haven't already. That will obviously lead you to this screen here. And then scroll over with your mouse here and you want to come over to apps, which is like, what is that, five over? And then it should be in features. If it's not in features, go to categories, go to sports and find ESPN or you can probably hold down this. Let's see if this works. ESPN app. And that should probably be the easiest thing. Yeah, that's probably going to be the easiest thing there. All right. So I showed you a couple different ways there. We're going to go to ESPN. Even though it says ESPN, that's the app you need for ESPN Plus as well. Since I already have downloaded it, once I hit that, it will already log me in here. So it's real simple. Once you do click on ESPN, a little highlighted yellow thing will be like download it now. You hit confirm, it'll download. You hit it again after it's downloaded, it'll open up. So once you do click on ESPN, they are very smart with their promotion. And it actually gave you the option and the layout to do in order to purchase the Fury Fight tonight. It says step one, sign up for ESPN+. Plus. I click that. It told me that it's going to be $4.99 a month, cancel any time. I hit confirm. It makes you sign in with your Amazon password. And then I have extra security two factor. So I had to enter that code and then I was signed up for ESPN plus super simple. Then it says step two, buy the fight for $79.99 or $79.95, whatever it was. I had to re-enter my Amazon password once again, and also re-enter my two factor. If you don't have two factor set up or don't know what that is, scratch that part. That doesn't matter. You just enter in your password. In my case, my two factor as well for added security. And then you come to this menu here. So literally, I can watch any of this right now. I can watch the early undercard. And your next question is, well, where is it billed to? It's billed to the credit card or debit card that I have set up on my account for Amazon. And it will actually tell you like the last four digits of the credit card. And that's all done through Amazon.com. Might be in the settings menu here, etc. But then when my buddies get over here, they can Venmo me or pay me in cash or I can treat them to fight night. We'll see. Again, it's only $4.99 a month ESPN plus plus the price of the fight. So I just got this for like $84.95. I can cancel ESPN plus anytime, but even if I canceled it the next day, I'm still going to be charged $4.99. So just write a memo, cancel it after three and a half weeks. So you're not billed $4.99 again the following month, or if you enjoy it, then keep it rolling. Well, hit that thumbs up button if it has helped you guys for tonight's fight or for future UFC fights. Hit that subscribe button. We got a lot of videos on the channel. Check it out. Thanks, guys.